Alright guys, hey, what's up? This is Michael with APK Time. Moving on with the video, we're going to cover pretty new live, free live TV movies, TV shows out that's come on the scene called Red Flicks. And I'm going to give my utter and most complete honest review on this. So uh, let's go ahead and get started. Got Red Flicks right here on the screen. I'm recording this from Remix OS on my Acer laptop. So for those of you who don't know what Remix OS is, it is a defunct, non-supported fork of x86 that the developer no longer supports. Um, x86 is still in development, but Remix OS is not. But it is running on Android 6.0.1, which means it will still be supported by developers for a good while to come, especially since developers are still supporting Android 4.4. So anyway, let's get started with Redflex. So now I've got the app open, and it is open in full landscape view, just to give you a more broad view of uh, the UI, the interface. And uh, it's pretty nice. It's got, you know, your latest TV series, your latest movies, uh, live TV there at the top. And then you also down here have Spanish movie series. We've got our horror, hoy choy movies. Marvel movies, hoster movies. Uh, you got to search up there in the upper right corner. You down at the bottom, you got home, live TV, movies, and shows. Let's go ahead and jump over to live TV. Now, it's been my experience, and this is only my honest opinion, that uh, the developers of Red Flix could do some improving on their live streams. I understand this is live and free, and that channels will come and go. You can't expect a whole lot for something that's free. So anyway, but um, most of the other free live TV apps do have better luck with their streams, and I just can't understand why nothing on here I've tried works. I've tried this app on both here and on my phone, and uh, so anyway, let's just see if anything's working now since the last time I tried. And usually I give it about 10 seconds if it doesn't start streaming then. Uh, it's not going to. Some of these channels have more than one server you can tap on. But even so, none of those servers have worked well either. As you can see, I do have a full Wi-Fi connection on the bar down there. And tapping the play button does no good. So let's back out of that. We'll try another one. Sky Movie Select. And we'll just let that spin up for a minute or two. Not really that long, but a few, few seconds. Not doing anything there. Let's jump over here to back to home. Um, we're going to check out some of the video on demand areas. Here's your latest movies. See if there's anything in there that's worth looking at. I personally like the uh, Marvel section. Let's just tap on uh, Captain Marvel and see what happens. All you got to do is tap the poster. And when it goes to the next screen, it goes ahead and starts telling it to load. I mean, this is virtually a clickless VOD. If only all the other streaming app developers could do that for Cinema HD, um, Movies HD, or uh, any of the little uh, lesser known free ones on the Play Store, that would be awesome. So anyway, I let that play way too long. I hope I don't give me a copyright strike let's just go back up here to the uh, TV shows we'll do one of those real quick just to see what happens where do we go with it latest movies latest TV series all right so let's just go ahead and pick one let's go look at Sabrina and we're going to start with episode one and look at there just two seconds and it's playing you can't beat that now, let's just do a search to see if there's a certain one in here. Let's see, uh, Wentworth. And no, they don't have Wentworth in there. Okay, but they will probably be adding more as they go along. This is just to show you at least the video on demand for movies and TV shows is excellent. I would highly recommend this app just based on that. As far as the live TV, I can't say I would recommend it for live TV since... Uh, in most streams that I tapped on, and I didn't even cover most of the ones I tried earlier in this video. Anyway, I hope you found this video helpful, and uh, I'm going to do more videos in the future covering more apps. 
that this channel was intended to do to help people understand or find out about new apps that might be useful to them but at the time I started this channel we were busy working on further updates for APK time and I, that was just my thing to have videos about that so anyway I'm Michael with APK time don't forget to hit that notification bell to be updated for new videos give a like thumbs up comment down below what you think if you, if you think the video is helpful and uh, don't forget to subscribe to the channel I would highly appreciate it and so would the owner so until next time this is Michael and we'll see you in the next video peace